episode 5. Here we go. Good news, I fixed the sound department. It's all good now. No more issues. Uh, like episode 4, that's what happened. Uh, just didn't have any sound. I think it's a little out on my end. One second. That's, that's better, yeah. Okay, let me just check a few things, make sure nothing's happening. And I think we are ready to get started. My device down. Uh, everything I need plugged in. Xbox, check. And we're going back to Thick Boy, which is actually a female, because I, because I wanted it that way, and that's how I'll have it, damn it. Let's get this party started, shall we? <laughs> yes, the stream is quite early. It is only almost 9:40 where I live, but that's all. That's a okay. We're just gonna be chilling. Uh, where am I going? This way. This way. So I just finished the, the Blight Town and the Quay Lag. Oh, that song's nice. So we, that's Demon Ruins with that open uh, wall right there. But we're not gonna go there because that's that's not yet. We just sat at the bonfire and lit it and all that just so we can uh, have it for a place on the, um, for when we grab the, what's it called, the, the ring, the, the giant ass ring, uh, that thing, yes. I forgot what it's called. Uh, yeah, what's it called, um, the Lord Vessel, that's it. I, my mind blank for a moment. But, since we just finished Quaylike's Domain and we don't have the Lord Vessel, we're going the long way around. And since I did set that bonfire, it's gonna take an extra long time now. I mean, I could run, but yeah. Let me just okay. So I got some souls, twenty-one thousand nine fifty. I could probably level up my character. I'm hoping to level up uh, equip load so I could put armor on this time. Because I'm just a naked person with a hood on. And yeah, I don't want no one run around naked, especially when things are trying to murder me. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me just check Discord real quick, make sure nothing's happening. Nope. Okay, cool. Anyhow. I gotta run really fast or else the rock guys will throw shit at me. Not actual shit, they better not. Just like that, just like that. Rocks, rocks, rocks. Oh dear, no. Get out of my way. I should have gotten the rusted iron ring from the asylum, but I forgot. Okay, it's all okay. It's all okay. We're all good. We'll be fine. Now go up this path, I think. I how rickety uh, this uh, Blight Town was, just like in general. It's all good though. Let's just get up here and let's finish this. Next, we have Sense Fortress up next from the cutscene that, that I last played when I. um. When I beat Quaylog and rang the second bell, because that allowed that allows me to get a sense fortress, which allows me in turn to get to Anna Wanda, where I have to fight my my the definition of a nightmare. Shit. No, no, no. My disappointment is immeasurable, and my day is ruined. How would I miss that? I I never miss that. I just feel like an idiot that I slipped through the crevice there and just and his face planted onto the ground. It's not concrete, it's like mud. <sighs> or dirt, I don't know. Oh, back here. Should I try to running jump? I didn't have enough room to do a running jump. There's no way in hell I could have done one. Eh, <sighs> whatever. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So, Incense Fortress is just like a giant tower with a bunch of axe swinging axes and other bullshit. So, we're just going to have to get through the best of our ability because I don't like the place. I find it tedious and annoying, personally. It's just... I don't like it. Every time I try to help someone with it in, 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 in the game, like when I get someone as a phantom to help with them, just like, oh, I dread this moment. Now, to, instead of running back from this bonfire each and every time, I'm going to run a little further... Cop that bonfire right there. I'm gonna cop the bonfire, and then I'm going to then have a closer checkpoint to the uh, exit, so I can just run up and out. It'll be much easier. 
for a, for a gloomy white town fell, it's just like so meh feeling. Rolling, 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 and I'm poisoned. Oh, I heard something that I don't like. Yeah, it's just one of those fire guys, it'll be fine. Yeah, fellow, fellow person, hello there. He's just gonna walk into the swamp. Or should I just risk it all? I don't feel like risking it. I'm just gonna run to the bonfire real quick. Can't touch this. That's what I thought. There. And it gets rid of my poison effect. It's much better. Heal me up. And let's roll. I just realized I still had the fireballs that I never used. I haven't used them since, like, uh, maybe Asylum Demon. I just found no use for them, personally, but but I couldn't use them in Twilight because uh, she's resistant to fire, so it wouldn't have been very useful. I'm, I'm poisoned again, but it's fine for now. I'm not going to die immediately. Poison is a very slow effect. Oh, my soul, so I better not lose these things. Okay, we're going to try this again. I'm gonna just get on the very edge and up, 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 and away. Hey, got him. I made it back up. It's good. Before I finish going up, I should probably. Oh, wait. A stupid bug thing. I'm gonna have to wait before I eat the purple moss pump. I'm just trying to be very gentle. Yeah. Okay, those, those toxic bastards are shooting those darts again. I better run. Ooh, that was a little closer comfort. I mean, it wasn't exactly near me because it hit a wall, but it was still oddly close. Um, I need to find it. Quick, quick, quick. I don't have the, I don't have the blooming stuff. That'll do. I can't use stay on ladders. I just remembered. I gotta climb up this ladder quickly. Heal, 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 please. Thank you. Ooh, yee. Okay, move out of the way. Thank Granny. <sighs> Yikes. This is not looking good already. I just have to run out the, the mouth of Blight Town. Just run and run and run. Ooh, a chest. Let's see what we got. The key to New Wando Ruins. That's where, you, that's where you can use the Master Key if you have it. And that's a shortcut you can use just to go through the Blight Town in the back way. It's much easier than what I was doing in the previous episode. Out of here. See ya. Hasta la vista. Can't touch this. Whoa. Okay, he hit me. He hit me. I'm gonna die of poison if I keep this up. I be careful. I, I just like how I was taunting him saying you can't you can't touch this and I immediately got smacked in, in the back with a giant a giant wooden stick. <sighs> it's all good though. We're in Valley of the Drakes across the bridge. It's a tiny bridge. Woo. Almost fell. Soul and name of soldier. Can you under ruins? Check. The key has been used. Now I can finally use that blue, blue purple moss pump and get rid of the poison. I could have waited out to be honest, but I just wanted to be safe. New Wando Ruins. This is this is a place, all right. I just gotta take a look at this guy. It's like he's like pulling the the, se the sexy French pose on us. Like I, I'm trying to get a better thing. Uh, let's read the message. Weakness rear. Nice. He's like pulling the sexy French pose on us. That's pretty good. Anyway, uh, blacksmith down here. Uh, let's talk then. Okay, let's reinforce my armor if, if I can. Let's repair equipment first, because I have a lot of garbage to repair. Some stuff that got pretty damaged. There we go. Um, purchase. He's got heavy soleros. These would be useful if I was a magician. But I, I don't play. I don't pull rabbits out of hats for for a living. A item? Yep. I remember. I this game way too well. Another soul of a nameless soldier. Epic. 
is the lift down here. Or, oh, it's up there. Hold on, I have to pull the lever. Oh, come on. And yoink us. Adjust my hat real quick. Okay, there. I'm wearing a tattered hood cloth and tattered cloth machete. I think that reads. I don't know. I think that's right. Yeah. Look at that pretty face. That's gonna that's gonna win uh, um, uh, the most beautiful person contest. I swear. Oh, the music of Firelink. I'm back. That feels good. No, put a smile on my face. It's like the music's really good. Like the music in the Dark Souls series has always been a staple of it. Like it's really good. That's a, that's like not. That's what makes up like seventy percent of my playlist. Oh. Ah, oh, fuck. She's dead. Rest in pieces, Firekeeper. Oh yeah, you're dead. Oof. Oh, I forgot to deal with what track. Fuck. Okay. Oh, uh, not a problem. Not a problem. It's just. Eh, wait. That means the bonfire here is operable. Ah, crap. Okay. Okay. I uh, see, you, Mister. He says there's a giant thing over here, and it snores. Oh yeah, that's a real ugly looking. Hey, it's Squidward, you guys. Let's see. Let's talk to Squidward. Mm-hmm. Sure. Cool. Well, yeah, or, what else do I have to do? Let's talk to him real quick. Okay. None of return. Face chosen. You proceed with caution. Okay, cool. Yeah, farewell. See you, loser. Um, so we can't use the firelink bonfire because Firekeeper just dd would She's, she's like, oofed out of existence. That's not a problem. We'll just, uh, move on. We can stop at the Undead Parish bonfire. Oh, that's another bell of ri awakening ringing from, um... Yeah, I'll go say that's the bell of awakening. Uh, that's the bell that can ring. Let me just make sure my microphone's working right. Let me just scroll up to that real quick. Making sure everything's good. Cool. Now, onward. Undead Parish houses the bonfire near Andre, and then that's how you get to Sense Fortress. So we're gonna go do that then. Yee -yee. That was close. So, after Dark Souls 1, or Remaster, whatever, I'm just gonna play Dark Souls 2 Scholar of the First Sin, the DS3. I don't have, like, a special edition for DS3, I just have the DLC with it, as I bought it separately. But, anyways, um, I'm gonna be playing this after this. I'm gonna take, like, a small break from Dark Souls after this series, but yeah. I need to buff this so I get, um... Oh, what's it called? I need to get, um, uh, 10 S's. That's what's called. Our first Halloween and then Kindle. Looking good. Looking good. I'm now human again. Amazing. And Kindled. Perfect. Let's pop quite like soul real quick. And these other souls. So I can. Oh, my hand went through the wall. Oof. I love the thing with the remaster where I can just choose multiple souls. That makes it like so much easier. And quite like soul, which is next around 15k, I believe. 8k. Okay, I'm way off. Uh, level up. See what we got. We can what's what upgrades? Uh, that is it. Endurance. Then upgrades equip load. Cool. Uh, just buff endurance to twenty. I'll take that. Sure. Now let's find some more armor. So I'm not just a naked uh, person running around. Um, tattered cloth robe and heavy boots. I I mid roll. That's not good. Let's remove the leggings. Not fast roll. Okay, just need a little more and I can find more better armor. Now, sense forward. Let's do this. Hmm. 
<laughs> so, what that stands for is a trap right there. You can see the raised tile. Yeah, thank you, Mr. Message. What we're going to do is we're going to lure the sneak people out here, and we're going to kill them. Over here, big boys. We didn't expect this, did you? Haha. -ha. I'm gonna backstab. I missed. Where's my backstab? Okay. Over, over, possum. Then, if I could parry him, thank you. Right in the dick. Ooh, that's gonna hurt later. I'm just gonna roll around him and attack. Only seven. Oh god, I forgot to upgrade my sword. Let me go back to Andre real quick, and I have to upgrade my sword. Do I have to play Titan? Let me check that too. I have two of it. That should be just enough to get to plus one. Okay, and let's go and meet Andre, the buffest dude alive. He's like John Cena, but if John Cena was was, but he's cooler than John Cena. Oh yeah, the large ember will tend to him. And it's a reinforced weapon. Where are you? There you are. Oh, I, I'm I'm short on souls. I could upgrade it again. Hmm. Uh, oh, Jester, I'll take that. Sure. Uh, let's reinforce our. No, let's reinforce my shield real quick. We're gonna reinforce this one, even though it's not the shield I'm using, just so I can um. You know, use that one in the future. But for now, the wooden shield will just have to do. Let's crack my knuckles and let's move on. Okay, where do we have to go? Right, sends four. How could I even forget? And it said the bonfire, so snake people have not returned. They're dead still. Some souls back here. Brave warrior, check. Oh, I forgot to set the bonfire. Now I'm not healed completely. Eh, I'll be fine. I'm working on my speed run. I just gotta go. Wait. And then run. This guy's real easy. Lorem. Repost, repost, please, thank you. And stab around the no-nos. Throw him off a cliff. Okay. Very gently, let's walk across the bridge. We don't, we now one-shot them with the repost since we, I upgraded my sword, which is good. Just gonna heal up real quick. Kind of hard to see because of my screen, but how it's positioned. But I think there's a guy shooting lightning right there. Just gonna shield it, then book it and shield it. Oh my god, thank you. Get behind him and just off the trap. Murdered. Chest. What do we got? Large Titan. I'll take that. Even though it's gonna be useless, I'll take it anyway. Well, not useless. I gotta bring my shield and armor with it. Haha, ha, snack. Get wrecked. Uh, he's coming back. He's coming back. Watch him fail. Oh, oh, I failed even harder than he did. Okay, let's back it up here and heal. The boulder, supposed to, the boulder was supposed to kill him, but apparently it didn't, so I'm sad. That's all, that's all for the fun of the jokes, just seeing a snake get run over. That's glare on my screen. It's hard to see what I'm looking at. There's a boulder coming to my way. There. Run. Run, 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 run. There. I made it. I made it. I made it. Now I gotta run all the way up here. Kill this guy. That hurt, mister. Oh, he bit me. He bit me. Shit. Oh. That causes a lot of bleeding. That's a lot of damage. Phil Swift was right. Heal up, heal up, heal up. 
Roll, roll, roll. I'm making bad decisions every day, but that's just my normal life. Hit him. There, boulder. Take care of him. Perfect. Is this a mimic or not? I can't tell. Alright, they gotta look at the chain. If the chain is curved, or like in a half circle, circle thing, that's safe. If it's kind of loose, or just like in a straight line, kind of wiggly, then it's no, it's a mimic. People gotta remember that, or else they get they get bamboozled. Let's take these souls real quick. I'm gonna wait for that boulder, and we're gonna run, we're gonna run for it to the fog gate. Cool, a useless fog gate. Run, 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 run. Okay, there. Um, if you're the squeaking, that they just changed, or they did it again. They just changed the um the boulder direction. Cool, he's dead. Okay, there's a little trick I've I picked up. If you can backstep through boulders, if you time it just right. So I'm gonna run up as far as I can, then backstep through a boulder. Here I go. Here I go. Turn around. You gotta backstep it. Watch. See, I did it. I'm a god. Whew. Whew, 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 whew. Hell yeah. And we're not gonna turn it because we have no reason to turn it. So we're just gonna step on the pressure plate. Get rid of those arrows, bolts, things. Weakness anywhere. Thank you, miss. Thank you, message. Very interesting. Now we have to cross the gap here. That's a lot of swing axes. Just gotta be very gentle. The path is getting thinner and thinner by the second. Oh, he missed. I'm just gonna run past him. I don't care. This pathway pathway is very thin. I have to be very gentle. Please don't die. Thank you. Oh, I got a viewer. Hello there. Um. Yeah, this is episode 5. If you haven't seen the previous episodes, they're on my... Uh, shameless plug here, but they are on my YouTube channel if you haven't seen episodes 1 through 4. And there's a bonfire right here if you are extra ex observant. There we go. Light bonfire. Cool. Let's set this make it our new bonfire so we don't have to walk all the way up from the undead Paris bonfire. I don't know if it's just me, but that's, that explosion thing is a little out of my ear, so I'm going to turn down the volume. Much better. I just gotta keep rolling and rolling up the stairs. That's how you, that's how you walk upstairs. You, you don't walk up them. You roll up them. That's what Dark Souls taught me. So next time, if if you can, just roll up the stairs. You got fast roll. You can't you just uh, fat roll. That that's not very cash money. Uh, where is it? Brave warrior. There we go. Soul. And up we go. Just check something real quick. Oh, uh, like night shards and, and hmm, uh, where to go now? Oh, we can get Ricard's rapier or some other goodies somewhere else. Hold on. Ah, <laughs> ow, ow, ow! Fire's hot. Fire is hot. If you didn't know hot, hot, hot things are hot. I learned that from, and my microwave taught me very well. Um. Okay. Next is the boss fight, which is up here. Breathe in. And I'm ready. Let's do this. We're not, we ain't afraid of no ghosts. We're not even fighting a ghost. That's not too new on no ruins, but we're gonna fight him anyway. I, I, I actually haven't seen Ghostbusters in a while. I should probably watch that movie again. It's a great movie. I just haven't seen it in like five years, maybe. It's It's been a while. Oh, up the stairs. Um, come on bumper thank you work with me sometimes my xbox bumper just like my right bumper just says just malfunction which is awesome now we're gonna take a little shortcut here and we're gonna summon iron Tarkus, the man the living legend better than than the undertaker and john cena combined you got iron Tarkus, the man the living legend let's get it let's get a good view of him what a chad this is good he's, he's good at whatever he does Boom, boom, boom. 
There he is. Let's go fight the boss. But before we fight the boss, we have something else to do. We have to go kill the giant at the top of the tower. He, uh, he, well, else he's gonna throw fire bombs down. Those big fire bombs. And here he is. Oh. Oh, he's going full sicko mode. Okay, there. Let's hit his head then. We can't reach his head, so we're just gonna hit his arm. And he's dead. Perfect. We got a Titanite chunk. Let's find this. Let's see if there's an item here. There is not. Okay. <laughs> now, if we look through one of these windows here, we can see the boss, Iron Golem, right there. It looks intimidating, yes, but he's not, I swear. He's really easy to take down. If I die, then I'm just eating my own words, and I just feel like an idiot then. Oh, he's gonna do the dust blast one. Yeet! Yeah, roll right over that. Uh, bumper, thank you. Oh, 158 damage. We are killing him. I'm doing 77 there because I switched to one handed. I'm just going back to two handed, I prefer it. Man, it's just the Dark Souls 3, me talking. Come on. Sometimes my right bumper just decides it's either the right or the left side. That, that they have to click or else the bumper doesn't like do the action. Iron Tarkus, please don't die. I'm begging of you. Oh god, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for if this me it's like the camera speed. Oh what how did he grab it? I was under his legs. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Roll, 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 damn it, roll. I am not dying and eating my own words because how much an idiot I am. Iron Tarkus, no. Okay, I did three hits. They're not a single one registered. Okay, I'm officially disabling the lock on. It's hurting my head. Trying to, it's like spinning around very fast. Come on, bumper. Oh my god, it's not even registering anymore. Let's just go for it. Go for it. Hit the entire bumper. There. Whew, I need a new Xbox controller. When the Series X comes out, I'll be so glad. I'll just maybe like take apart this controller and replace the bumper. Or just check the wiring. Make sure nothing's wrong with it. And to Anorlando we go. Wow, we actually beat Sons of Fortress in under 30 minutes. Now that's, that's a record. We have done it. It has been finished. Just checking a few things, and we are ready. As these demons carry me off, I am officially done with Sen's Fortress. And now to the beautiful land of Anorlando we go. Um, Anorlando, I should I should have probably made the title a uh, Sen's House of Fun plus Anorlando, but it would have taken up so much space on the uh, thing. I wouldn't people wouldn't have even seen the Anorlando part. Oh, I love this area. It is so beautiful looking. And here we go. Let's go back to one handed. Now, these enemies are significantly tougher. I didn't even use any fireballs, which is interesting. I could have used fireballs while Tarkus hit it up front and just uh, attacked it. Uh, well, I just shot fireballs at, like, my first aid of them. It's whatever, though. Let's just walk to the bonfire. It's right there to my left in that little opening. It's right there. So let's go and uh, let's go and set the bonfire, make it our new bonfire. So if we die, we don't head back all the way to Sun's Fort. That that suck. I don't know how to even die unless I engaged an enemy or something. Perfect. And that's this. <sighs> Pure happiness. I'm done. At least with Sun Fort. Let's talk to this person. Okay. I think yonder means straight. But I'm not sure. Okay, cool. Uh, reinforce? I don't have a firekeeper soul. Hmm. Well, that's not a problem. Let's just, uh, let's keep going then. So, how you're supposed to do it is 
um, there's a building down there, and you have to break through it, or not break through, you just have to get through it, and you have to, like, walk on these cross beams, that's, like, very deadly, and I hate this part, it gives me the willies every time, it just makes me think, I don't want to die again, so we're just gonna have to be extra careful. Mm -hmm. Hey, Gargoyle, welcome back, old friend. Yeah, okay, for some reason the lock-on doesn't hate me. Oh, God, I got smushed. For some reason the lock-on doesn't hate me for this guy, but when I had to fight uh, Iron Golem back there, he was absolutely annoying. I just kept spinning around and around. Um, cut it. Bumper. Please work. I'm stuck. Okay, there. Bumper. I have to press the entire bumper now for the entire for just to do it once. Well, I had to press it in one area before. Now my controller is just breaking down. I treat them with respect. I just don't understand why my controller is deciding just to to die. I got my Xbox like when did I get it? I have a tendency to get every console three years after it launches for some reason. I have a Series S or not Series S, sorry, just a One S, and apparently I decided to buy it three years afterwards. I bought mine in 2019. Back off, back off, back off. But then my Switch, I bought 2020 of January. So I bought it almost three years after the console debuted, which is interesting. Here's a little fact what I find interesting. That's about it. Come on, entire bumper. <laughs> Why? Why can I not just press one part of it? Stop, stop flying around, you piece of shit. Get down here, back. Don't make me put you in the kettle again. It's the longest time I've ever had to fight this dumb gargoyle. I'm gonna take off walk off. It's getting very dizzying. Oh, he might kill me. Jesus Christ. Roll, 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 roll. Okay, he didn't attack me. That was interesting. I'm just gonna heal again. It's just the safe thing to do. Block it. Walk around him. Oh, he missed. Come on, bumper. Jesus Christ, man. Come on. Just do the long attack. I missed. I so missed. I am not bad at the game. I've honestly, I, I, okay. I've over, I've over a hundred hours in Dark Souls Three. Uh, I swear I'm not bad at this game. For this game, I don't know how many long hours I spent in, in this save file at least. I beat the original Dark Souls like a couple times, done the remaster twice, and then this is gonna be my third playthrough or my fourth. I don't remember. I play this game too much. He's dead. I got the gargoyle shield. Amazing. What a what a what a piss poor shield. It's just not even good. It doesn't even protect you that well. That's eh, whatever. Let's move on. Let's just up the balcony railing thing. And we gotta roll onto here. Let's not mess up. Perfect. Now, there's a broken window here you can see without getting cut on the glass. I managed to walk through with bare feet because I'm good at that. Okay. This is going to be a problem. I'm going to have to switch Xbox controllers. I, I left my blue controller downstairs. Uh, wait, is, he, is that guy still alive? No, he's dead. Okay, I just thought he was still alive for some reason. there like I can't get a backstab if I'm circling around and I press the wrong part of the bumper and that bump part of the bumper just decides not to work so I have to press the entire thing so just like left or right or middle I don't know I personally don't care I've, I've, I'm, I've been done giving a shit for the rest of my life for a while I just have to walk very gently I do not want to fall I don't want to lose all five fifty five thousand of my souls that's a lot of souls okay at least for a new account. Like, for a new game plus 5 me, that's almost no souls. It's like, it won't even get me a level in Dark Souls 3. But here, it means a lot. Okay. As you can see, that, air, that needle they're starting is slowly pushing me back. I'm just trying to be very careful and hold on for as long as I can. 
need to make a plan of action or until he walks over here. And then you just have to slightly bend around the corner until he misses or hits. Please don't, please don't kill me. No, bumper, thank you. Oh, I'm about to have a heart attack. Please do not scare me like that game. I don't want to have a heart attack because you decided to say, oh, you pressed the wrong part of the bumper, moron. Try again. Oh, God. I'm really going to freak out if I miss. Okay. Very gently. We cut this chain. Okay. You know how I press the entire bumper? It's not even registering now. That's also very fun. You break that chain. The chandelier drops and breaks on the floor. And it reveals an item. I think it's a... Isn't it like a pyromancy? Which I actually need, because I am a pyromancer. I'm just going to scooch to the side. Maybe he'll roll off the cliff. Thank you. I got one more guy. The final challenger. And I can finally get off these dumb uh, beams. I'm like on ceiling beams. It's like the most terrifying thing ever. I think when... Uh, Miyazaki made the game. He was like a programmer. He wasn't even programming. Maybe help program. I don't know. But he probably like thought of the idea. Let's make players almost shit themselves when they're like on the very edge of the of it, and they're just like, uh, yeah, yikes. <sighs> okay. If you just walk over here, it'd make my job a lot easier. Oh, I'm gonna fall. Ooh. No, okay. I'm dead. No. I took that the most careful route, and I in my hands were just my palms getting all sweaty. I'm just like, I don't know if I can do this. I was freaking out. Come on. Take a sip. My water from my throat completely becomes the the Sahara Desert. Much better. So. I don't know how what I did wrong, except existing. But that, that's what I do wrong every day. I just exist. That's not a problem. I'm just gonna try this again. Just go down the elevator and up the rafts again. The rafters. Um. Oh, no, wait, don't leave without me. Thank you. Whew, almost missed the elevator. Oh, it reminds me. <laughs> but I don't, but I, you gotta play the elevator music. It, it's key to winning. Hey, uh, one second. I have to mute myself. I apologize about that. I am back. Um. Uh, someone was calling my name, and I had to quickly respond, well, and I didn't want to play and, you know, fall off a cliff and lose all five, 55,000 of the souls. So, here we go again. Let's not mess up, let's grab my souls, and let's get out of here. I just hate this area so much. Ooh, ooh, oh, dear. I almost missed the roll there. Come on stop with them stop with the promag bumper why okay i think i'm just gonna shoot the fireballs when i'm trying to attack those guys on the rafters because it just might be easier die please i missed entirely why did i think that was a good idea that was a horrible idea heal 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 Oh, he missed. He missed, like, by a, milli a millimeter. That was way too close. Come on. There. I was just spamming the entire button multiple times. Okay, let's pull out the fireballs. So let's be very gentle about this. Oh, it's in DS3 where you hold the Y button and you can holster your, uh, your sword and hold out your shield. I forgot. Okay. What we're gonna do is we're gonna walk out slowly and steadily, so we don't want to fall. That'd be a very bad idea. Oh, God, I'm terrified. <laughs> okay, we're gonna walk gently and carefully. We're gonna walk on target, and then we're just gonna shoot a fireball. Unless they end up killing themselves, either way, we'll be fine. Step to the side. 
Oh, that worked. I have no idea how that worked. You know, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm a risk taker like that. I take risks. Like, I, I can't even list any risks I've taken in the past, like, 15 years. But that was pretty risque. Um, on the edge again. No, I can't lock on anymore. Hold on. He'll have to come at me eventually. He'll have to stop throwing the needles. There we go. What an idiot. I think that when they programmed the AI to do that, I don't think they were thinking that it was going to happen like that. Okay. Carefully. I got my souls. I got my souls. Okay, we're good. Uh, needle. I can't shoot a fireball at him. The animation is way too slow. I can't. I just can't. It's not a good idea. Let's advance up a bit. Maybe like that. Oh, he killed himself. Oh, praise the sun. I won. No. We're not gonna die yet. If we die right here, I will legit be sad and mostly disappointed, but really sad. Roll, thank you. <laughs> so, I've done it. Victory. We're gonna give like I don't know if I'm gonna make the ONS in time. I'm gonna take a shortcut of parkour. Uh, parkour. And then I just jump around. Yeah. Let's heal up so I don't die. That that was really close. Now, my favorite part of the entire game, you gotta crank that soldier boy, so let's crank it. Get, get it crank. I, I, I've reached my big com comical uh, career of just how funny I am. Yeah. Anyway, we, crank, we cranked it down, so now we have an even bridge across the way. That's perfect. Isn't there another, like, gargoyle supposed to come around here? Oh, yep, there he is. Okay. I do not feel like fighting this guy. He will kill me if I try. So we're just going to run away. Now, what I forgot to mention is before we reach ONS in the next bonfire, we have to go through the one of the most treacherous parts in the entire game. And this honestly frightens me. I hate this part. So I'm going to take some deep breaths, relax, and we're going to do this step by step. <laughs> and we're not going to make dumb monkey noises along the way. I, I hope I won't. Um, okay. Is these things, you can just dodge to, to avoid these. Like I said, I thought I could avoid them. Little, little did I know I was wrong. I was really wrong. <laughs> Crap. Yeah, I'm kind of laughing. I thought I could escape them, but I'm just making them. I was like signing my own death pact by doing that. Not a problem. Okay, back out there. So now that we have an easy access route, we don't have to do the uh, the things ever again. And so that's done. Oh, almost walked off and fell. That was cool. Or not cool, it was close though. Check some things, make sure everything's in working order with the stream. Cool. I think the gargoyle is still there, but we're just gonna avoid him like a pro. I just wanna check something real quick. Um just make sure I'm just keep going for a second when we get to the bonfire then I'm gonna check uh, something make sure everything's in working order mostly the stream I also make sure I I do have the stream working I just want to make sure nothing else will go wrong please don't hurt me thank you if you if you ask maybe he'll be nice and just and just not hurt you he'll say oh my bad family continue on you don't know he might be nice Whoa, over the top, three-pointer, 
and uh, other phrases that I don't know what I'm talking about. Oh god. Come on, bumper. Thank you. Now it seems to be the edge of the bumper. That could change at any moment for some dumb reason. There, he's dead. Ow! Oh, it's the gargoyle. He's followed me. This guy's reputation to follow me, so I'm just gonna run. It's the safer bet. Now we're gonna heal up really quickly. And we're gonna run by. Here we go. Oh, I can't see. I can't see. That was close. Oh, arrows. Giant arrows. Big arrows. Oh, dear. Now, it's not only me, but I can barely see my screen, so I'm going to turn up the brightness a little bit. Okay, that's much better. Okay, arrow's coming from yonder. Let's, let's run. By run, I mean jaywalk. Slowly. Hmm. Up to the top. Oh, no, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I beg of you. Ah, uh, Jesus! Nah, I didn't. I didn't have enough time to quit out. Um, that's another trick you can do, like especially on the on the rafters. I was struggling with. If you quit out right before you hit the ground, you spawn up on your last solid platform that you're standing on, which is a little, nice little trick that Aces in the original and the remaster. So, very remastered Bandai Namco. Very cool. I mean, if they were going to remaster, they should put a little more effort into it, but. It's, at least I can play it on modern consoles so if I can rip out my 360 each time I want to play Dark Souls. I mean, yeah, the original Dark Souls is backwards compatible with the, three, with the Xbox One, but I just prefer... I didn't have the DLC part of Dark Souls 1. I just bought the base copy. You know, it's lucky, though. My friend... I, I don't know how I managed to get into this tangent, but my friend managed... To, I, got, I got him Dark Souls for his birthday, the original, and he somehow got the Platinum Hits Edition, which came with the DLC. I'm just like, yo, that's crazy. Uh, so lucky him, I suppose. Secret ahead. Yes, there is a secret down there, but it's just a Titanite slab. Or not slab, but a Demon Titanite, which I don't need. It's not part of my build that I need. Should I kill the Gargoyle? Probably. Eh, I don't feel like it, Mr. Krabs. That's fine, now. Uh, let's just keep going. Ew. Okay, we're not killing him. He, he's just gonna massacre me. I, I just don't wanna die. Please don't kill me. <laughs> Run up the beam. Okay, let's heal up real quick. Make sure he's not following me. He's following me. He's following me really hard. Okay. Okay. Okay, mamma mia. Let's not make those dinos yet. Oh dear. Okay, miss me with that. We don't do that here. Okay, that hurt. Just gotta run, just gotta run, just gotta run, just gotta run. Please don't hurt me. I'm just a wee boy. Okay. Okay. That's all good. I need to get my souls back after I absolutely lost them from messing up really badly. By apparently shielding it is a cardinal sin. You don't shield the arrow or they knock you into the void. <laughs> like I said, even if you don't shield it, you still get hit by it. On. Don't die something this silly! Now I'm only slightly mad. I, th I think I just made the stream here and, and I'll continue Anne Orlando later in the next episode because I didn't I didn't name this one Anne Orlando. I named it something else, which it's whatever. Eh, it's almost 50 minutes in. It'll be a good stopping point for today's episode episode stream thing as I still have to upload this to YouTube and other stuff that's why I have Chrome open I hope it's not taking up too much RAM so that'll be the stream for today so thank you for watching to my one viewer and my two users in chat that was originally three but now it's back to two which is fine and oh a, th a third one a third one is here welcome but I'm ending the stream here so goodbye and 
Peace out.